Hopkinton boys cross country is getting ready for the season and this year's squad is led by four motivated captains. Young Wang and I'm a junior. Uh, Ian Holmes, I'm going to be a senior. I'm Brendan Cochio and I'm going to be a senior. And I'm Jack Dion and I'm going to be a senior. Head coach Jennifer Fairbanks is entering her 11th season at the helm and is enjoying working with an experienced Hillers team featuring many familiar faces from last season. Uh, we're good. We're good with numbers as we usually do. We have 53 boys signed up. We have about 10 new freshmen, so we'll see how they come into the group. Um, we didn't graduate too many of our top 10, so they are returning, which is very exciting. And we have a good number of really strong sophomores that I look forward to seeing how they're going to run this year. For the first few practices, they've had some great weather. We've been um, lucky to have some great weather so far. Our coolest weather ever, which makes it great for running. We also were able to get one of our, our first meet bumped to the end, so we've got a good three weeks to practice. So we're going to continue building on the base that they've hopefully been running over the summer, um, get some road mileage in, and then we'll start building in, in the speed to get ready for the meets themselves. I asked the captains about their background with cross country and some of their goals for this season. Um, so I started cross country in eighth grade. I wasn't really much of a distance runner, but I, I'd give it a try and turns out I had some potential, so I worked at it and I trained every summer and since then I've been running cross country. Yeah, I actually only joined the team uh, last year, but uh, I've always been a runner. My mom and sister run marathons uh, every other year, so they always take me out, drag me out on their long runs and everything, so I've always, since a kid, been running, but last year um, didn't have a sport to do in the fall and I decided that cross country was really a good place to so get back into running and do it consistently and meet some new people and uh, I really enjoyed it and it's been a good time. So this is my second year in cross country. I joined uh, my junior year and before that I was originally a football player but um, head injuries caused me to um, stop playing and I had to find a different sport in the fall. So last year I tried cross country and I absolutely loved it. I loved running, I loved um, just being on the team and doing all the activities and I just really um, got into it, started running a lot more in the off season and um, making friends with a lot of people on the team and uh, got more involved. And then going into this year, I've just been um, working really hard, trying to um, be a leader and uh, stay healthy throughout the season. Yeah, so I've always been a runner. Um, my dad got me into the sport uh, when I was around 10. He gave me uh, $50 if I could stick to an eight-week running program. Um, so I did that and I just kept uh, going with it and ran, uh, running more and more, ramping up my miles. So I started in eighth grade um, on the team and started doing their 5Ks and the town 5Ks and then um, all through high school. So this will be my final year. But it's a great team, great sport. I really like it. All right, and what are some of the things that you're working on to get ready for the season right now? This season, I think I've just been building my base, really building up the mileage for the summer. I'm not really thinking about going too fast, just more how many miles can I run in a week and have that base to start the season with. All right, and do you have any goals for the season? I want to get a 1735K. That's my goal. Uh, just, you know, staying healthy, uh, getting stronger, um, making sure that you can last the whole season because it's about two months and it's, uh, the schedule's pretty vigorous, so you want to make sure that you're, you're icing and you're stretching, you're making sure that, you know, you, you, as Young said, have a good base to really, you know, hit the ground running and not fall behind in the early days. Um, so that's really kind of the goal that you set early on, but I guess an individual goal for me is trying to get uh, under a 19-minute 5K by the end of the season. Um, and that's something that I'm going to achieve. And if I get that, you know, maybe set the bar even higher. So I'm looking forward to um, working towards that. Yeah, my goal is to uh, break 19 minutes on the home course and to stay healthy throughout the year. It's a uh, it's a long season. It's hard to stay healthy. And um, yeah, I think that would be a good goal. Uh, my goal for the season, I would love to see my senior year, the team win the TVL title. So that's my goal.